Well, it's moving day today. Lots of people are coming. I think we're all going to trip over ourselves. But you can see we do have some balustrade. Yep, not everything's finished. There's bits and pieces, painting, but there's a lot of boxes to move. It will be mouldy. Oh, I hope it works. Hey guys. Some exciting news. We have moved in. All the progress that we've reported, we are finally here. And at this moment, we're on the pontoon enjoying wine and canapes. I've been in charge of the renovations. It hasn't always been easy. The professor checks in from time to time. He wants to know how it's going. So we get on Zoom and go through the various aspects. My feet feel so warm. You can see there's a missing one and a missing one there. A fair amount of design and planning went into the butler's pantry. I wanted a tile design that was a bit on the Moroccan style. So I searched the internet and I found a company with these tiles called Arabesque Porcelain White. I reckon they really worked and they matched the photograph that I'd saved on Pinterest when I was planning design of the butler's pantry. You can see in this video that the bench top has been installed now. It was being lifted up in the last episode. Very heavy. Come and say hello to Andy. Hello. Here he is, look. He's come to help. Hello. <laughs> Hi hard. Andy. You're working your hard. It was foreseeable that we would have great difficulty moving beds, couches, large items of furniture, refrigerators and piano up the narrow stairway from the ground floor. So this balcony has hinges and it opens. That balcony has no hinges, so there's no access inside. To the first floor, a stairway that had a right angle turn in it to the first landing. So it was going to be impossible. So what we did, we designed the Juliet balconies in front of the French doors for the Juliet balconies to have a hinge. Just the one Juliet balcony so that when it came time to move all the furniture up to the completed renovations, we simply opened the Juliet balcony and the lifter lifted all the large items of furniture and all the small items for that matter through the Juliet doors via the hinged Juliet balcony. So the main kitchen is being installed, but not in the time that we hoped. It means I move in, but I won't have a bench top there. I do have one in the butler's pantry, and the plumbing will be installed. I'm happy. Well. 
it's the first day of moving in. We've got a forklift, removalists, painters, cleaners, helpers. It's a nightmare. But the biggest disaster is the Moroccan rug has been damp and has some pieces out of it. I just want to cry. It's from the Sahara Desert and it's been made by Bedouin women and it's unique and it's got a bit of damage. I just don't know what I can do about it so pretty distressed. So I've moved in and I'm doing tradie hours. I'm up early every morning, making sure there's coffee and cake and getting things organized. It's great to see these things get done. I was left instructions by the professor. I need a ceiling in the garage. Right, I have to organize it. I need the electricians. I need the builders. And I need to coordinate it all. Join us next episode when you start to see some painting. It's been a very long process, finding the method and the colour. If you like this video, please remember to subscribe. It helps to keep this channel going. Bye for now.